is the season to be jolly. Today we are going over gift ideas for physical therapists or physical therapist assistants since we are heading into that holiday season where you will be buying gifts maybe. Unless you're watching this video at like a different time then I guess it wouldn't make as much sense or maybe you're just shopping for a birthday or maybe they just graduated the program. Maybe this was a bad idea. Where was I? This video goes over 10 different gift ideas and if you want to know what any of these gifts are, you can go to the description of this video and I will put a link to each of the items that I mention and talk about. That way you can easily access them. Let's get started. The first gift idea I have for you is called a goniometer. And what this device does is simply measures range of motion. So how much can someone bend their elbow or bend their knee? We use it in physical therapy to test range of motion. But the cool thing about this one is it is digital, which most of them you have to kind of use your eyes like squint to see the little numbers on it. But this one is digital or you can use the old way and look at the numbers. So I thought that was kind of cool. Item number two is a Fitbit. Now I feel like this is a great gift idea for someone that is going into the health field, so physical therapy. It's a great tool to use to monitor your heart rate, monitor your steps. You guys probably know how a Fitbit works, but the one I have listed in the description is $98. Now you can get, you can get cheaper ones, but they will come with less capabilities. Their battery life will be less. They'll just have less function. The nicer ones can sync to your phone, play Bluetooth, all these different features to it. So. It depends how much you want to spend, but I feel like a Fitbit is a great thing to get for someone that is going into the health profession field or works in it currently. Item number three is a gait belt, which is used for holding on to patients so that we do not drop them. It's a very important tool that I feel like I use a lot working in an outpatient clinic, and I know I used a lot working in the hospital, especially you had to use it with anybody that you were walking. And so it's always nice to get a nice new gait belt, and you can get them in like cool colors now. My favorite one is the one with stars on it. It's like, it looks like America. That's my favorite. Item number four is a blood pressure cuff. Now these can come in manual ones where you have to do it yourself, put the stethoscope on, or you can get the wrist one, uh, which is digital. Now most people will tell you that the manual ones are more accurate because the digital ones can be a little finicky sometimes. So I think it's great to use manual personally myself, but sometimes if you're in a rush and you wanna use that one or you wanna double check it, Either way, blood pressure cuffs are good to have. They're most commonly used in home healthcare. So I carried one on me at all times. Working in an outpatient clinic now, I don't use them as often. So if you know somebody who's working in home healthcare, I feel like a blood pressure cuff is a great gift. The next gift idea I have for you is called a pulse oximeter or a pulse ox. And all this device does is it measures the oxygen in the blood. This item is more commonly used in home healthcare as well, something that you can use for patients, but there are times we use them in outpatient clinics or the hospital. It's kind of a neat little tool, fits in your pocket to have with you, and I think it makes a great addition to your tools in physical therapy. Gift idea number six is physical therapy apparel. And this is great for someone who loves the field. Even if they hate the field, get it for them anyways if they're working in it because there are a lot of funny, goofy shirts that you can get online. This shirt is specifically is one that I made and it's from my store. But I also have another link in the description for different shirts that I think are pretty cool. They're like the Friends shirts that, you know what I mean, like I'll just put a picture up or something so you can see it. It'll be way easier than me trying to explain it. But I feel like getting different shirts to support the profession for someone who works in physical therapy is an awesome gift. Gift idea number, where am I? Number seven is scrubs. Now nobody loves spending money on scrubs, but it is always nice to get a pair of scrubs. It's kind of just like socks. I love getting socks. And scrubs is the same way. It's great to get a nice new pair of scrubs, but here's the thing, if you do wanna get somebody a pair of scrubs, make sure you know what color to get them. A lot of times, if you work in different areas in the health profession, you're designated a specific color. For me, I had to wear teal because it just brings out the color of my eyes. You guys know. That's why I had to wear blue. 
Gift idea number eight is Audible. Now that is actually a platform that you can listen to audiobooks online through Amazon and you can actually gift this to somebody. You can buy them an account for either 12 months or six months or three months, whatever you wanna do, whatever is in your budget to do. But I feel like this is a great gift because a lot of times I will listen to audiobooks on the way to work or podcasts or anything like that. And so buying somebody a free subscription to Audible for a one year or something is just awesome. You can stay up to date on research. You could read bedtime stories. I don't care what kind of books you can read, but you can read books. Great gift. That's what it is. Number nine is a water bottle. And I know you're thinking, that's so simple and stupid, Tony. Ugh, I could have thought of that myself. Well, guess what, you didn't, I did. I thought of it for you, so now get yourself a water bottle. But they're cool ones. They, I think getting a new water bottle is awesome. I love water bottles. You can get those nice, fancy, cool ones that come in cool colors and just do it. Gift idea number 10 is kind of a silly gift. It's more of a white elephant type of gift but I think they're pretty funny and it is a bone pen. You can get multiple different kind of bones. So it's kind of silly, it's kind of goofy and it makes sense for going into the health field, working with physical therapy, dealing with musculoskeletal issues. So I feel like it's kind of fitting and kind of funny. We have them at the clinic actually. I forgot to bring one home, but we have them at the clinic and we use them. Patients think they are hilarious and funny and they don't, they, they write like light. They're not like, uh, they're not really wet. They're kind of drier for a pen, if that makes sense. So the quality isn't the best, but they're more of a joke anyways. So if you want to do something silly, then buy that. There you guys have it. That was 10 different gift ideas for someone who works in physical therapy, someone, whether it's a PTA, whether it's a PT, whether it's a student, someone in school. I think these are all great gift ideas for anywhere along the journey. So hopefully it was helpful. Please subscribe if you're new. See you on another video. Peace.